Two guys getting arrested. Anything you guys know about the arrest and what's going on? Um, yeah. So basically, right? Shut the fuck up. So basically, right? Um, my friend went in the store to buy weed, and he was gonna sell it to us, and we're minors. Which store is this? That he, uh, it's the it's, it's the, the smoke all shop the, all oh, the way down there. It's a smoke yeah. shop. Okay. So we go in there, right? We're trying now, to get do they weed. Have it there uh, for sale legally? Yes, for sale. I don't know. They don't didn't know. ask. Well, like, they sell it to minors. They sell it to minors. They don't even ask for your age. They just give it to you. Right. And then what you call it? We gone over there to buy weed, right? So it's not an illegal dispensary. I don't even think it's legal. So they go to ask for it. Because I think there's only like three legal uh, marijuana dispensaries. Right. Yeah. So basically, right? Uh, they thought he stole something, and he didn't take anything. Actually, they saw him beat him up in front, beat him up in the store. They beat him. Like there's two of them. And uh, yeah, mind you, huh? it was a gro it was two grown men that beat up a 13 year old that was on the floor. Yeah. You know the one that had, that with the bread tech that had got arrested, he got beat up by them and it ended up getting in cuffs. I don't understand how that makes sense, but I guess he's 13, got beat up by them. I'm and over here trying to. The, the, deli, think he the, guys from the, the guy tried to assault him because the guy in the deli right next to the smoke shop, literally, what you call it? He had a bat that had nails in it and he yeah. was gonna hit us with it. He was chasing he us. He actually with tried it. to swing it at them, yeah. And they had and they had to step back. Why do you think he did that? Because he thought that. I guess he was scared for his life or something like that. Cause he just jumped a 13 year old. You feel me? There's like it's like I think it was like six or seven of us out in front of the store. He, and he thought that he stole some weed or something. No, he thought no, he they stole thought he candy, 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 a like dollar it. candy. So he told he jumped him. Wow. And I don't think he, he's never been in our store before. And like for me, they just jumped him. Uh, I, he comes running to us saying, oh, I got jumped, I got jumped. I walked down there. And I'm like, what happened? I walk in the store, I see him. I was like, yo, what happened? Why you jump him? Da, 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 da. He was like, get the fuck out of the store. This out of the third. Mind you, I wasn't hostile. I was just trying to talk, right? 
they called the police, right? And I'm guessing they said that he assaulted them or something like that. He didn't touch them. I don't think, I don't believe he touched them. Because he's small. They just beat him up. All right. So, yeah. Did they call an ambulance for this guy at all? No, they just, they put him in cuffs and put him in the back of the, in the back of the police car. They took him to the precinct. Right. Okay. And I don't, if you guys encountered anything like this before, these smoke shops, you know, some of these smoke shops. Yes, literally. What you call it? We, um, it was... I'm gonna say it was all the way down there, which I'm gonna call it. Like, me and my friend, we, we went in there to buy weed, right? He didn't ask for any up, age, up, nothing. He just came over here and said, oh, here. He gave it to us. Like, he literally gave it to us in another smoke shop. It's on fucking 17th Street. Bro, he said, no. Me, me and my friends asked him, right? We were like, oh, can we get like a dime for $5? He said, yeah, here. He gave it to us. Like, these are fucking, like, not like legal weed shops selling kids to fucking, selling weed to minors knowing that you're gonna get in trouble and they still called the fucking cops. I'm surprised he didn't get in trouble. Yeah, they said he tried to lock him up. They didn't. And he tried to beat him, he tried to hit him with a baseball bat with nails and stuff. I was there when he, when he tried to hit him with a baseball bat, but I wasn't there for the kid to be a jump. But his lip was bleeding and stuff. I was like, oh, he just got jumped. And mind you, I don't usually resort to violence. So like, I talk a lot, I talk a lot. So like, I'm gonna be like, I went in there talking, trying to be calm. He got, he picked up a baseball bat. I'm like, why are you walking towards me with that? I was gonna, I was gonna, I was gonna hit him, of course, cause like I'm like you coming towards me with a big old bat with nails on it, and that's the first thing I peeped that had nails on it. So if he hits me, that's penetrating my skin, and it's over. Uh, were the workers uh, in trouble? The or workers were no. watching. Cause they he were ran. The, 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 another thing is that he ran from one store to another. So I'm guessing that store helped him out some way, so he wouldn't. I, so he got yeah. like a friend of his. From no, 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 no. He wasn't even from that store. He was from the deli right next to him. He came in he the store. He was friends with the guy at the deli. Yes. Probably, and then they just started jumping him. And I'm, bro, me and my friend, right, we're sitting there, we're yelling at him. I'm like, you're a dumb pussy. Why are you doing that to a 13 year old? Just because he stole a dollar kid. Like, you could literally and he didn't go even steal to the it, deli and That's buy him. He, he didn't even steal it. it. He didn't even steal it. He probably saw him. Candy. Yes. Yeah, he yes. probably saw them like put it. But even if even if you accuse somebody of stealing candy, you don't put their hand, you don't put your hands on them. They probably saw him like putting his 13. hands in his pocket. He's 13. Like, bro. that's really a kid. Like he's 13. He's just now hit a puberty and stuff. You feel me? Probably going through a lot. He's living in a home, in a, in a uh, children's center. You feel me? With a whole bunch of kids that that you feel me? Their family don't want to take care of them. Uh, both of them live in the children's center. Yes, they both do. One of them is my roommate. The one that got arrested was my is my roommate. So I was like, you know what I mean? So you guys have to experience that. Uh, do you want to give your names at all? Oh uh, no. Um, That's fine. You don't have. To. I am Natalie Hill Wayne. So, Natalie, can you spell it? N a t a l i e h i l l w a y e n. Thank you so much, guys. Appreciate it.